onto a table. This is a really good class. This has really challenged you guys. And what we know on pork carcasses, it's all based upon cutability, which is trimness and muscling. In beef, we look at yield grade, which is cutability, but we also look at quality grade. And in pork, although it is very important, we don't talk about it as much. The only time we get all hung up on quality is when we have got a pork retail cut or a wholesale cut that is really, really super, super light in color, because we call pork a reddish pink, and there is a pool of wet stuff underneath. This is what we call the butt face. And when that happens, that means those muscle fibers are not holding on to its moisture. And when that happens, then, when it is like if we would have just a lot of exudate, and if I would just take a knife and just cut a slice off of that and throw it in the cast iron skillet, it would end up being about as dry and worthless as the sole of his boots because it's lost all that moisture. So, when we look at that, we look at cutability, which is muscling and trimness. We look at beneath and alongside the butt face. We look over the ham collar. And I just got through telling you, you have to move your feet. So the other thing you need to do, and I want you guys to get in line behind me, and you guys are gonna act like you know what the heck you're doing because you're gonna stand in the cooler and you're gonna get down and you want to look at the depth of this cushion. You want to look at the width and depth from the butt face, but you also, this is a center cushion, and you want to see how deep that is. And if it is really deep, is that due to a lot of muscle in that ham, or is there fat taking up that depth? So I want you guys to just, and, and you're gonna get down here and you're gonna look. And I want, I'm gonna ask you when you get done, which is the narrowest ham cushion in this class? 